Um, this year is more relaxed. Um, everything is like organized, going well, and you know, everything is just putting everything together from where I started when I first got here to now. It's been great. Um, since I came, it was an easy transition during the summer. Um, I was welcomed with open arms. Um, yeah, so like um, starting out with this summer, like May, we kind of just kind of hit it right off early in. Kind of got the girls together and had a plan set early in, um, in advance and kind of just, you know, went with that. Getting the girls together so they can be able to know each other because a lot of kids came from middle school. Um, a lot of, some of them are returning players, but not as many. Um, so that's definitely what um, kind of our summer went. Kind of just to getting the girls together, working out together, um, and just kind of build that family dynamic. Yes, the girls were very committed. They were very committed. They worked hard this summer. Um, and when it was game time, uh, they were all ears. Uh, they were open to listening to their uh, mistakes and they made sure that they uh, reacted or made sure they fixed their mistakes um, when they got into the game. Yeah, my team this year is very young, um, but actually I have two girls that actually stepped up, uh, um, actually doing what, you know, the coach is uh, asking her what them to do. Um, so right now it's kind of, it's a, it's a work in progress, but I can do see potential in them as well, as being leaders as well as how Jaylene was when she was here. Yeah, this year we actually growing in numbers, which I'm very excited about. Um, I think this is the first year we actually have a, a, a JV team that's really offering well, that's rotating in, so I'm really excited about that. Um, over the summer we had maybe 12 to 14, um, and now, like you said, we have a lot of them. Um, and so we're able to split them up, you know, with varsity and um, JV because at first we were kind of worried about how we were going to do that. But now it's, it's fine now. Coach Smith, she's a wonderful um, person to be around. She's it's great because now I got somebody that's in the school. So not only, um, you know, I'm coming in, but she's here with them. When I get here, they already, you know, conditioning, working out, running drills. Um, even when I'm not in the school, she handles the in-school disciplinary, you know, things of that nature. So it, it really balanced out everything as um, far as the team aspect. I expect them to come, um, come in prepared, uh, also be focused, um, and just have good character, good sportsman-like conduct. Um, we have a couple of challenging games. Uh, one of them I definitely would say Gardendale. Um, that's more at a higher level pace um, than what the girls are used to. Um, but right now, for our practice, I, I practice at a higher level pace now, so I kind of get them acclimated to, you know, what to expect um, for this upcoming season. And last year, my expectation was pretty much to get the girls to compete, um, you know, in the game. Right now, we are in the area of execution, you know. So right now, not only compete, but we want to execute every game, every play, everything that we can do to be able to, you know, move up to the next level. Um, the expectations that I have, I expect my girls to look athletic, um, to act athletic. Um, also, I expect them, again, to be all ears like they were this summer. Um, listen to those mistakes and make sure you go out there and attempt to fix them.